Lonnie Johnson. Lonnie Johnson was born in Mobile, Alabama in 1949. He graduated from Tuskegee University in 1975 with a degree in nuclear engineering. He served in the U.S. Air Force and in fact, he earned his first patent while serving on active duty. Now, you might not know Lonnie Johnson by his name, but I'm pretty sure you know him by his invention. He designed and patented the Super Soaker water gun. But what you didn't, may not know about him was that it took him seven years to bring that product to market. His first time trying to bring it to market, he was quoted in manufacturing $200,000 for the first 1,000 guns. It was a chance encounter that he came, he went to the American International Toy Fair and he had a chance encounter with a toy company that decided to, we'll try to bring your product, to, we'll, we'll partner with you to bring your product to market and see what happens. He had to sue Hasbro in 2013 and was awarded $72.9 million in royalties because they cheated him out of money for his product. Now these are three significant engineers in African American history, spanning over a hundred plus years. The reason I use these three examples is because they show how over the course of time, African American engineers have been cheated out of patents and cheated out of those royalties. As a result of this happening, generational wealth was stolen. And because that generational wealth was stolen, we have the type of problems that we have today. 